Hello and welcome to Crazy Hank TV Survivor Chat. I'm your host, I'm Reem, and I walk softly and carry a big stick. We had another episode tonight of Survivor. Uh, I thought it was the best one so far. It, you know, some st different strategy going on, some mistakes being made by players. Uh, we did find out I have five hot takes. The first one is Keith makes the right decision. He stays in the game. Nobody likes a quitter. I don't know how long he'll stay in the game after that because it seems like they're in a, it, it seems like they're having it pretty rough. So him and Reem, they find it, they get maps to the food. Or to a little bit of rice, and it doesn't seem like we didn't see how much the rice was there, but it doesn't seem like a lot according to Reem. Will they stay in the game? Will they raise the flag to, you know, say, okay, I've had enough? And who's I, I'm? We're guessing who's ever the last one there gets back in the game. We'll go go with that. Uh, we had number two, uh, Manu wins a challenge. Hey, happy for them! They won the reward challenge, and they won chickens, which comes into play later on with Wendy and Mad Dog and everybody. I'm sorry, War Dog, not Mad Dog. Um, and then we have uh, Aubrey looking for an idol, which is always fun to watch uh, contestants look for an idol. But she found, finds the idol and she cries because that's on her bucket list. And congrats to Aubrey. She needed to find the idol. She found the idol. Kudos to her. Then we go to the immunity challenge. And, and Manu is way up in front. And yet they get to the one part where they're trying to do the puzzle, the wheel puzzle. And they, they're not communicating. They're getting frustrated. Uh, Wentworth looked like she was going to kill somebody. Uh, but Manu came back. One and they win immunity again, so you know we they, they have to go home. Someone's gonna have to go home. Uh, I forgot to mention that Wendy hurt his, her ankle in the reward challenge. I thought personally, I would have. I don't know. Maybe she did this, but I would have gone down and soaked it in the ocean. Get some. It, I'm sure the water's pretty cool. Take some of the swelling down. But she got wrapped up and she stayed in the game. Good for her. And she was great in the uh, immunity challenge. She was swimming and having no problems. But her and the chickens, um, you know, I get it. You don't want to get the chickens, but why? Would, you're there to win a million dollars. You're there to win the game. Why make such a big deal about the chickens when you eat chickens? You know, you're 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 a, you're a chicken eater on on when in the real in real life. But again, I, I'm not there. I'm not playing the game. I I don't know. I'd have trouble killing the chicken, but I probably would eat the chicken. I mean, I'm, I'm a hypocrite. But anyway, she took the flint, hid the flint from everybody. Which I thought was a mistake, but she got away with it. So, so far, she's gotten away with it, but it didn't work. They were able to start the fire anyway without her. Uh, comes down, they're talking about who they're going to vote off, and, and and David and and Devin talk to uh, Chris, and they try to pull him aside, and he said, and he goes, "Well, you know, I, I you know, I'm I, I'm an honest guy, and I want to you know be honest with you." So they told him not to go to War Dog, but he went to War Dog anyway, and then he puts his head on the chopping block, which again is a survivor mistake. You don't if if you're not a target. Don't make yourself a target. Why do that? It doesn't make sense. We go to tribal. We're not really sure what's going to happen. I'm thinking it's Wentworth, and Wentworth is, is she's just wound tight. She's just ready. She's ready to go off on somebody. I, I wouldn't want to get. I wouldn't want to get in her way. Uh, but the votes come down, and Chris is voted off. Chris just uh, he killed himself in the game, and it looks like David and Devin didn't want to didn't want to didn't want to set up that they were the ones going after Wentworth. They probably made the right decision. Chris was that's what the group wanted to do, so they went with the group. Uh, went or survives again, uh, Chris, and then he chooses. But Chris does choose to stay in the game. I think he'll do well over there. He might, he. I love the three that are there: Reem, uh, Keith, and Chris. I think Chris has the best chance of getting back in the game, uh, just just based on, based on survival skills or something like that. But that that's it. That's all we had. Um, again, another great episode. Um, and I, my uh, crazy Hank player of the game. I'm going to give it to War Dog again because he's gotten his way again. You know, he's calling the shots. He he said he came back after Chris came to him, even though Chris was being just honest with him. And then Chris, you know, gets tossed and you know to the you know the he gets tossed out. But that's all I got. But I did have well, we did have some feedback last week on my little rant about, you know, searching for the survivors and Jonathan Sherby had a great I thought a great idea. How about if the viewers, us viewers, don't know who has an idol? So like Aubrey found an idol, but we don't know it. So when it's played we're in shock. We don't know who has the idols, and I thought that was a fantastic idea. You guys can you guys can give your uh, thoughts in the uh, comment section if you agree with that. Don't agree with it, but I I thought it was I thought it was fantastic. I I love that idea. I would rather not know who has the idol. It just gives it more. It just makes it more fun for the viewer if you don't know who you know what's going on. Sometimes you, well, when you have a good blind side, when you're watching the thing, oh my god, I didn't see that coming. Well, if someone plays an idol that you don't know they have. I think it makes it more exciting for the viewer, but. Leave your comments. We'll see. We'll go with it. Um, anyway, that's all I got for today's show. If you like what we're doing here, share it, like it, subscribe to us, tell a friend, tell 
lots of friends, and we'll just keep going on with this. It's we're, we're, we're having a lot of fun with it. So that's all I got. I'm out. Bye.